Hello everybody, again, another video here, because it's my birthday coming up on Sunday, 10th of May, my 21st, I'd just like to review this Virgin News Train Pendolino I got on the 11th of May, a day after my birthday. I have been after one of these for ages, Virgin Trains Pendolino. I have been dying it for one for ages and ages. I kept on going on and on up on my friends. I said, oh, for God's sake, why don't you get the model train for your birthday? But I did. But when I did today, you get, a, I can't, you get the newer version. If you go on to someone else did a really good review on the Pendolino last year, I will, I will present to you, present to you, just oh, the camera down, here they are, the newer version these the newer version here's the newer versions of them and this is what another user done this is what another user done this is another user done they're both lights all lights light up and everything this is if you go on to two of the two of the channels or maybe one of them proper did a really good review on the Virgin train pencil you know Oh, I have to tell you something about this one in particular. I bought this off a friend. It's how she had this part, this particular unit had to, had to, had to have surgery. This unit had to have surgery because this was the original Pendolino out of that box. That one was the original. So basically, my, I bought it off her. It could have been made with, with four of the coaches, but one of the coaches kept me repairing. So. It tilts, and this is the old one. This is in the original livery, which the fleet number is 390012. That's a that can pour a nine car separate. And this one, which they are not quite by how long, I can't remember long ago they released this one, because this one is in the Astoff livery. Comparison for comparison. For comparison, here we go. You've got the same style of train, but they're just in different livery. They just have different livery branding. Yep, yeah, they have different livery. Same locomotive. you got trippy couplings. you got a good... Uh, like the door. By law, you have to have the yellow on the front. That's by law. Light, all lights light up. On this unit, but for unfortunate for this unit, the original unit, um, this part broke. This part broke, so I had to get a replacement. This one is the replacement one. Then, unfortunately, the lights don't work. If you see the videos, I've pulled the pendolino with this sort of unit. Um, there we go, there she is. She's got the ass stuff on the front. And now that now let's take a look at the coaches. Let's take a look at the coaches. Let's take a look at the coaches. Ah, oh, this coach first. This is just a standard Pendolino coach with first class, but with one on the windows. And a bit of black around the frame of the window. And of course, you've got the usual couplings. That's the kind of couplings I need to fix for the other coin. And it's called Astoff, Astoff and Pendolino. Yeah, if anyone sees that in service, just, just drop me an email if anyone sees it in service. Let's look at the pentagraph pop. It's similar to the original models. But unfortunately, I accidentally broke the pentagraph pop. Um, yes, if you see my other videos, you should see this Pendolino with the extra pentagraph pole. I made it into a five car train, even though it's supposed to have four. Here we go, that's what I want to say about the Pendolino. Here's the comparison, here's the comparison of the liveries. There you go, just before the end of the video, I would like to just give you a tour of these Pendolinos. They've got the same engine, the same locomotives, but just different, different fleet numbers. 
and different running numbers. Or should I say, they have the same engine, same locos, but different livery. I'll, I'll have to end it here. I'll, have to do, I'll see you lot in the next video on my next loco. Bye.